So yes, finally, finally, finally. So of course I'm back on it really quick. What? 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 But of course, um, Dugger Battle video. So, of course, we got new news, new stuff, of course, for Doken. We do have a lot of new stuff coming up. We have a global newsletter from Coda, of course, for the anniversary, and they always do it no matter what. Even JP have like little Japanese stuff like that as well. They don't do it as much global, on the other hand, on the, on the social media side. Always, always, always goes crazy, no matter what, though. So, yeah. Um, I forgot to say timer for my recording. Dang it. Who cares? Doesn't matter. I'll, I'll stick going on no matter what, though. So, yeah, of course, I'm going to talk about the business as well because, um, because the very time recording do drop tonight. I get out, probably upload this video maybe the same time it comes out. I kind of doubt it though, but I'll try my best to just because I can just actually, yeah, I'm going to upload this right after my um, anniversary breakdown video because that video is like 17 minutes long. I remember JP was a little bit shorter than that just because I was talking about everything, going over everything. It was insane, crazy. The goal that came out, it's like, yeah, I did this stuff already, so I'm like, I'm already used to it. But also got a little bit more bonus stuff as well, like this um, newsletter right here. Again, Global always does this. Now, producers like Global always does this, and every, any type of big celebration in general, Kota will kind of fought out, like the Gohan and the AGL, LR Gohan and um, Future Trunks. Um, but yeah, AGL, LR, Future Trunks, and One Arm, and of course, Tr uh, yeah, Trunks. You know, future LR, uh, LR Future, a AGL, LR Future, One Arm, Future Gohan, and um, Trunks. They um, actually went over them and broke them down. I actually turned off the unit there when that key actually came out. Makes sense because I was like kind of near. Not no, it, for JP's it wasn't Christmas. For Global, it's kind of a different time. I think went to February, March, I think. I can't remember though. But yeah, we have stuff like that basically. And I actually really liked it myself though because it explained that it's over stuff. Simple, easy, straight to the point. Really good stuff. I like it though. Of course, Coda is back again with another little of course news update and everything. Let me fix it right here. It's a little bit cranky today. Cranky, 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 cranky. But yeah, uh, of course you got the Duck and Battle shirt. I got my Dragon Ball shirt on just because I have been always I'll be wearing the short videos. It's so comfortable, so good, so amazing. But yeah, this video shouldn't take too too long. I will talk about the banners, of course, gonna yo. But yeah, um, of course, the Blizzard will be playing in the Doka Fest event for um the gods for LR yeah the LR gods. Then of course part two, this one's gonna be playing for there too for the EZA levels. And phase seven of the ultimate red zone for Broly and more. And of course, Don Don, the, um, the GT opening will be playing on the, of course, same thing, like the Sin, for Sins, at least um, the Sin slash Omega, of course, um, Red Zone. Um, it was a four Kodeo, it was Omega, the um, end of the anniversary part two celebration. Um, and of course, you know, the ultimate, the Joker Festival event, pretty much. Chella Hitchella will be playing on the main title theme. I know Global has, they should have a new theme up right now for the home screen and the regular screen in general. Like Chala Hitchla then came out in part two. So Global got that really early though. Global got a good benefit. But make sure to turn out turn off the music completely if you're doing videos. Try not to do too much of it though because again even a little bit even like one volume of it, not even joking, even one pixel of health, even one little thing of it, it can and will get you copyrighted though. So just kinda of be careful about that though. I'm not gonna copy copyright because I'm not playing any songs. I never do that anyway though, because again that's a whole minefield. It, it, some people got past some people got past around it because you know it's in Doken. I don't know if it's like copy because in Kid JP had like on there for a long time. Even like Legends did too, but I guess they had to they have it they had to have it for a limited amount of time because we can see like through here like the whole anniversary sale is gonna play in part two and further beyond. But um it should basically 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 um should um be not crazy today though so um yeah but yeah though um again that's pretty much it though for that again don't make sure have like a new home screen thing which generally should be just permanent because that regular thing just sucks and then again for what five seven years now at this point so just kind of let, let it go just literally make that main thing the main thing and the tower theme which is it's so good then i think we have like a part two wallpaper like goku the goku family the gf family like, you know, flying off together pretty much, so that should be a wallpaper again. Also, it's probably going to end up being a wallpaper at some point. Every title screen is going to be a wallpaper at some point, though, too. And of course, actually, we're getting a cloud figure for JP right here. Um, so yeah, so we're going to be thinking this is a cloud figure. There's a guy going to got Vegeta. I'll probably release it in part two, but this is for, I don't know if it's, I think it's out right now for Global. It might be, I don't know. But this is for, um, the LR, of course, like Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta again, and of course you have a special QR code. It does release on July 2022, no date, again, typical stuff though, in local stores, like bookstores like Bars and Noble, where I live, and like, um, just again, Starbucks and stuff like that. They, they kind of fuse them together, usually, where I live, so I did like at least two or three of them where I live. 
So yeah, check like your local Barnes and Noble and like bookstores and stuff like that. Cause these are always like I found like the Clyde Pickers from like last year. I think I saw like Int the Int Vegeta from um um the sixth year, I think. I saw like Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta's um cross arms, like the pose he does like Super Saiyan 4 SSR art. Um that was there too. I think I had a like, Gogeta again, like you want to go credit again. I just made videos on the Clyde Figure. Do you guys know I love the Clyde Figure videos? But yeah, there'll be special guard code for it and stuff like that, of course. Uh, for figure arts, um, zero Gogeta. So, of course, that's going to be there again. Um, yeah, again, they're just figures and stuff like that, of course. They're on um, everybody the anniversary. Honestly, they never released it for Gold Ball. I'm shocked they actually did. Probably because it got so much prints on JP. I know they think they released the Super Saiyan boards. I know they, yeah, they did it kind of later, though, but they didn't like pre pretty much put it on baggage, though. But I've done so many figure videos like leading up to the universe of what it could be and stuff like that though so yeah that goes right here um of course the swimming event will be on the 7th so again 7 7 doken 7 usually on the, on the 7th or the 8th again it's specific standard time so whatever time it is for you probably i think what early night i think for fifth year they did that i know four years they did that for six years somewhere for some reason it was at three o'clock and people were getting it in waves and the game was just lagging loading crash especially for the seven year for jp this year like potential orbs like it was four year when that first came up with duplicating that and that dragon stone stuff like that i think even for this anniversary i think too for jp it was crazy and just chaotic and stuff like that though but um but this specifically though again it should be on the seventh or eighth or ninth they always change it up every year though so not to be shocked to be get like on the eighth or ninth that's delayed or whatever though so yeah it's always gonna be on seventh this year um yeah, so they have more news and stuff like that they couldn't cover in the video though um big surprise there's one more announcement they'll be um bringing a new event specifically like for this anniversary i think though yeah for the new international version they'll be um spending time basically um doing a new event a secret new event for the um, for this anniversary which is utterly insane gold has never done this before at all having something exclusive for their anniversary because jp and gold will kind of keep their stuff somewhere maybe there's some global campaign stuff though but overall Really insane. Like I didn't expect them to do something like this. I kind of feel like they were going to because seventy year anniversary Gobo wants to go all out. But you kinda of love this superior to JP, get them hands dirty, get that marinade, get that sizzling Vegito blue steak done. Um God yeah, marinating of the gods and Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta hands in there just dirty, going crazy and just flapping everywhere, just you know, everything. But yeah. Uh, but also, I'm going to go to the bench real quick, so I'm going to edit out really quick, come right back and uh, about, talk about the new event coming up, because it's kind of crazy. Did the goal would do something crazy like this, though. But yeah, good go over the banners and stuff like that, talk about them for a second. So yeah, edit out phase. <laughs> edit back in phase. But yeah, um, <laughs> she did that. But yeah, this is the banner right here for Global and of course, JP. Again, the banners never changed. Of course, Global's going to have red coins, discounts, tickets, and the Doobie ticket A and B. I think those are already, already pretty much for Global already, so that's really good. Awesome. Again, super simple, super easy. That's something that you can easily just, again, just simple and easy right there. Um, this second banner, again, some of these banners, they are worth it. Um, I say this so many shorts, so many videos in the past and stuff like that. Yes, these are worth it. You know, the best banners in Doka history. You cannot argue me on that. These are the best banners in Doka history. I don't care what you guys say. These are the best banners in Doka history. And I love them. They're amazing, awesome, beautiful. Again, just good. I don't care, they're both amazing. I love this banner more, but I already have everything on here pretty much. So I'm probably gonna just go for this banner. As I say that now in the video, I'm gonna get cursed. So there you go. Then of course right here we have the regular, the inverted rainbow ticket. Again, this is what I'm talking about too. Uh, we have a regular ticket, we summon this ticket A. Again, first very first summons will be discounted. I think it's like what, 25 stones, 20, 30, then I think like 45 or 35, they usually change it every time. Um yeah, no, I was going to say 32. I don't know why. I just, <sighs> Brad is on copium today. But yeah, um, this is the um, inverted version. It's, it's the same version of the banner, just that you're using tickets like last year. You get, some, you get these tickets via missions that you're doing in the game. You cannot, like, you know, you can't keep them for the party hours and stuff like that if you really, really want to, but you don't have to do it though. I'll say something to use it for here because you're getting more value and better, um, better just stuff like this in general. Plus, every animation is going to be between an LR animation. You have high trigger games at large this year. Probably any other year, because again, it's LR rates, so you're in those things like crazy. But yeah, I think 10 LR is pretty much in the banner. That's insane though. Like, you got a couple SSRs on here. Um, but yeah, um, again, you can't, like, you can't be like, oh, you know, on these, save them all up for the party LR banner. No, you, you have to, you, you, you pretty much, they're all connected though. So, whatever better you want to summon on, or use them on. There you go. Even then, Gold's gonna have a regular ticket banner, this ticket banner, um, coins, discounts. Uh, That's why I say being on Gold was just so superior. Enough. But yeah, 
the Chris get the record logging bonus tickets. Again, we log into the anniversary record, you'll get the tickets again. Not at the same rate as this Ganga LR, but there are all the LRs are here that you can get in the same same you can summon those, so that's simple and easy there. Again, it's a lower chance not a lower chance, but again you could get an LR here or not. I usually get like two or three LRs every year from this though, so this is a really good value. Then of course we're here at 7 7 unit. Again, you get three LRs from each era. The all broken up in groups for global. Bowl. Again, you get part one, I think has 45. Um, you get like seven extra ones. Then of course part two is going to have probably like 76 out of 77. Then of course part one 77. There'll be EX part for like Super Saiyan 4s and Super Saiyan 3, Goku and Vegeta, I believe. Super, no, Super Saiyan 3. The, um, int, the three year, um, was it three year? Three year and of course the four year. You just gain ECAs. So for the LRs, they're getting ECAs. So yeah. We gain three LRs for each era. Part one, two, and three will have the same amount of tickets. The very last part will give you the last tickets so we can summon and stuff like that. Simple, easy. Then of course this is how it's broken up. Again, this is group A, so whatever. Again, the very last three units, 76, 75, 76, and 77 LRs. Um the last three again, you could get like this Goku, you could get Beerus, and you could get um this Goku Black again. It's all random. So yeah. Okay, you could get some of like the third LR, the very last LR will be this one, the second to last one will be this one, and the first to last will be any of these units. So this is broken up to three parts though, so that's simple and easy there. So yeah, again, you could get Vidya Nappa in this one, this one you could get, I don't know, Cell, and this one you could get, um, Broly. But yeah, there's anything I want to kind of cover with Gorg today. But yeah, like I said, nothing like crazy, crazy, crazy. I mean, of course, again, Gorg Geek is cool, so I've made new newsletter. New anniversary stuff, a lot of craziness. I got a lot to do today though, so yeah. See you guys later though, thanks for watching. Have a great day, great luck. And though, make sure to stay safe, watch your hands, God bless. I hope you go out, point on that. Until baby, before we read to, but get back to the if you can. Go outside, just subscribe to Scorpion. Shout out to all my friends on Discord, and socials, everywhere. I hesitated there for a second. Twitter, everything. So we gotta think about all this info though, of course, like change it again. Very simple, very easy, short video. Newsletter was amazing. Going over the banners and stuff like that. Again, I'm gonna talk about these guys a lot. They're good, they're awesome, beautiful. Again, a lot of stuff, wonderful host stuff already though, so yeah. See you guys later though, okay though. So